Hey, stop looking. Stop it. Stop. Money was a bit tight from the expense, but I have zero regrets, which I disagree with. Oh, okay. uh, fucking fuck you, bitch. <sighs> anyway, the new shoes should arrive today. To whom should I put them on first? Um, <coughs> I don't know. I straighten myself and stretch. Five dolls watch in silence. Uh, endlessly watching, endlessly judging. And continue watching every day, 24-7, including when you undress and shit. Although yeah. they're lifeless dolls, it has become a habit to talk to them like this. Darn! I'll be late! I have to get ready. What are you gonna do, bro? The clock was heading towards eight. <laughs> My uniform sprawled on the floor and was heading out the door. Oh, when I suddenly halted. Is she in high school? I hurried back to my room and said goodbye to the dolls. Watch the house, everyone! Yeah, tell your dolls to watch the fucking house, you idiot. They said nothing in return, <laughs> but I said They're bye dolls. as if they were real people. Uh, <laughs> you gave yourself an actual asthma attack. <coughs> oh my god! <coughs> Fuck that me. wasn't a purpose! <coughs> I was able to make it on time after catching the last bus. Is that your school? It says yeah. Kroby. What? It says Kroby! Yeah, that's why I'm like, what? Why is it? Who cares? Fuck it. I was in ruins <coughs> after dying, after surviving the crowded bus, but all that matters is that I wasn't late. <coughs> I'm really gonna wake up early, starting from tomorrow. Otherwise I'll die like this. Thanks. <coughs> I pledge this every day, but I've never actually done it. I'm looking to see if they'll give me heights for them. I'll tell you the heights when I find them. Slash if I find them. Oh, did the UFO rise from the west today? Fix your hair! Although it really is a talent having your hair stick up like that in different directions every morning. Who the fuck is this bitch? Huh? Oh. Hi, good morning. I sit on my desk, pressing my stuck up hair back to my head. Those are some heavy footsteps. Yes, this is the sound of a murderer. She approaches the seat next to me. The way she sweeps her shiny, voluptuous curls, or the way she drops her eyes, reek of elegance. I don't like to put reek and elegance in the same sentence. All you have to do is see see her fearless voice and confident moves to notice her self-assured personality. All you have to do is see her voice. <laughs> Good morning to you two! Okay. That was the voice I went with before we saw her. It's true. What do you do every night that makes you barely come here on time? Do you have a secret boyfriend or something? She kills me. I pass well, out. I do have doll boyfriends. Um, this is creepy. <laughs> Last night I was so absorbed with taking pictures of the dolls that I went to bed at dawn. <coughs> this is actually like legitimately on. Like I'm worried for her. Hey. I hear another voice behind me. I turn around and see a girl short boyish hair right behind my back. Okay, I guess I'm her. Girls in the class stirred as they saw her standing slanted with her hands in her pockets. Okay, she's not very slanted. Hi, Shinbi! So Shinbi and I are called the trio in this class. Because we're 
are unoriginal and shitty. Sui and Shinbi were childhood friends since they were little, and I became friends with them after I entered this academy. <coughs> I never thought I'd be friends with them at first because of their gorgeous and showy looks. Yeah, at first. So, what did you think? What? Sorry, I missed it. Say that again? Hey, I was talking here! Are you staring at nothing again? Anyways, about this, here. Which design looks better to you? Hot. So he handed me a magazine. Oh, it's the cutie! Top five cute dresses in trend for girls. The gorgeous <coughs> model posing in a pretty dress looks familiar. The name of the model written in the bottom left of the page looks familiar too. Okay, first of all, that's our first sign that this is bullshit. Cause I've never seen anybody created a fucking model in my life. Shindy. Ever since Shindy was street cast, she's often classes for modeling work. <coughs> okay, I've reduced heights of the Lados. So, Lance is five... Five, where the fuck is that? I don't do math good. Um, five, six. Mm -hmm. Um, fucking red fuck is the same. Um, this guy is, uh, Tay is five, nine. Um, in a shocker, which is not what I was expecting, uh, <clears throat> Yonho is 5'4", so my expectation of Lance being the tiniest was wrong, and, um, Yuri is 5'9", I think? Uh, yes, 5'9". So, Google did the math for me, and now we know their heights. Sally tells me she has a lot of friend, fans and is quite popular nowadays. <coughs> but Shindy herself doesn't seem to be into those <coughs> things. <coughs> Ooh, er! Anyway, Shindy, you're everywhere on the magazines nowadays. Isn't it hard? A bit, but... Oh, fuck, I fucked up. I thought, but it's okay. <coughs> I bet. It's okay, though. <sighs> ah, you have it tough. You should have said no like I did. Zoe was besides Shindi when she was cast. And Zoe was offered, too, but refused. Right at the spot. to meet cute male models? I asked her why later on, and she replied, and she replied like this. <coughs> tsk, tsk. You have a long way to go, my friend. Modeling isn't it. I can't be satisfied with just looking. I want something on a higher level. Yes, I'd rather be a designer who can touch the models as much as she wants. She wants to have an excuse to molest people. <laughs> Apparently. That's, like, she literally wants to be a designer just so she can molest dudes. After that, away. I didn't listen carefully. I would agree with that <laughs> statement. Don't, just, just don't. <clears throat> God, it's so bright. I was wondering why today was so quiet. She turned her head towards flashlight. The fla flashlight? What? <coughs> oh, the, fl like the, the light that gives God. the flash. Countless phones were flashing through the windows on the hallway. Oh, and shit, good. Has become 
common. Oh, thank God. Due to Shinbi's rising popularity. I, 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 I looked up and I thought that they had blinked and I had to stare for a while to make sure that wasn't just me. <laughs> <laughs> but it was the game and yeah, no, they blink. Okay, that was really scary for there. <laughs> Everyone seems to have waited for this moment. They're more desperate because Shinbi missed class a lot last week. Even I just barely said hi at the cafeteria. <laughs> Maybe you shouldn't do the voice that's killing you slowly. Hey, why did you come to school that day if you weren't going to come to class? To like buy milk <laughs> yeah I feel that face great face I like how every time my line comes up I'm eating <laughs> like I think I'm good and then no there's one that's only salt hair yep I think that she just has a crush on one of her friends and likes to look at their face. <laughs> That's my theory. Probably. Oh yeah. Speaking of the cafeteria, I almost had a heart attack Bro. this morning. Bro. Bro. Do they not remind you of Sailor Uranus and Neptune, <coughs> but their collars are switched? Yeah. Bro. They give the uh, bro. Yep. <laughs> nice. Nice. <laughs> Alright, continue. <laughs> now that I- I was like, they're probably together since they first showed up. Lesbians! <laughs> that would be pretty cool. A heart attack? Why? Ugh. Okay, listen. We were heading to the cafeteria because Shinbi said she wanted strawberry milk. Do you really want to drink two of those in the morning? Beers? In front of ya. <coughs> what? What? I'm genuinely confused about what's happening. In front of ya. What's in front of... Ah! Oh god. I love this dude. It's morning and it's already noisy. <laughs> Mr. Mr. Eugene, what is that? You've been screaming and it's loud. I can still hear you without you yelling. What's the big fuss about? Blood! Blood! You're covered in blood! Who yells like that? And what's that in, in your hand? Is, is that a knife? Call Nyla What? Oh, this... It's nothing. This is... Here. Ew! Get that away from me! Huh? It's... Ketchup! <laughs> what the fuck was that? Now he has eyes. I like him a lot. <coughs> yes, ketchup. I wanted a burger for breakfast, but it was too big to eat. So I cut it with this surgical knife. Got some on my clothes. Uh -huh. This man needs a nap. <laughs> He's, he's, he's got that, like, Frankenstein from, from Soul Eater feel, like if he was a Bishonin. Why are you guys standing like that? Oh, do you guys want some? Okay, I'll share. He's my favorite, definitely. Follow me to the infirmary. Because I was going to call the infirmary. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and Shinbi, since you're coming anyways, I would love to have a serious chat about your fib you. Uh, 
I, eh? I got deeply confused for a second about what the fibula was. <laughs> <laughs> and then I remembered. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. I was on a diet. <laughs> we'll be off then. Adieu, Mr. Eugen. Oh, Eugen's my fave. <laughs> but I have no idea if he actually is of any consequence to the plot. Oh! Oh, yeah! Hey, bro! <laughs> Wait. I like him a lot. I really almost had a heart attack. I really like him a lot. Why did he have to eat a burger in the morning? And... So he punched the table. Why in the world did he use a surgical knife? To cut food. How do they take care of the equipment here? I mean, why is there a surgical knife in the first place? Um, it's a school infirmary. Um, we don't even learn anatomy. Um, you know, there's a lot of reasons that you could have fucking scalpels. Uh, really? I was crazy to have a crush on him just for his looks. Bro, his looks are great, and his personality only accentuates them, <laughs> in my opinion. Weren't cute looks all that mattered? What are you talking about? Good looks are just necessary for starting love. What comes next is more important for true love. Is it cash money? Listen carefully. Appearance is simply the first gate guys have to pass. The second gate is being normal. <laughs> Mr. Eugen failed to pass the second one. Hey, hey, hey now, hey, hey, let's not. Man, I agree he's not normal. Just because you he, know. Just because he's kind of looks like an axe murderer. What the third gate is? Cash money. What is it? It's manners! Manners! Oh, but if they don't pass the fourth gate, all of those are useless. The fourth one is... Money! Cash money! If she doesn't say money, I'm gonna be so mad. So his eyes glimmered. Cash money. Capability! Are you talking about... Fucking. <laughs> Her eyes are suggesting that might be the case. I mean, it feels about right for this girl. But again, if they can't pass the fifth gate, it's just like spraying soy sauce on a beautifully cooked steak. The fifth gate is... Hey, are you listening? No. I just hope that someone manages to pass all those gates before she becomes a wrinkly grandmother. Now I think about it. Yeah. The school nurse was looking for you. No thanks. Yes. What? Yes. Go. 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 See if you can't date him. What if he's like the wizard of this story? <laughs> I want it. Please let oh, it be right. real. He said you should stop by the infirmary. I want that to be the... What? The, thanks for telling me so quickly. <laughs> no biggie, Miss Health Commissioner. Have a safe trip. I wish you good luck. Yeah, go talk to my favorite character. <sighs> right, right, thank you. Why the fuck is it that these <laughs> fucking... Um, Charitz games take 20 years to get to the boning. I know. I stood up weekly. You stood up weekly and then fucking died or some shit? That perspective doesn't look right. <sighs> yeah, it's a little jank, I guess. As I walked, drowned in my thoughts, I quickly arrived in front of the infirmary. Ugh. Oh. Let's talk to the best character in the whole game. I 
should listen to Zoe and stop staring at nothing. Maybe. I tap both my cheeks with my hands. Okay. That was an unnecessary but adorable gesture. You looked for... Murder. Murder, murder. Oh, he's my favorite. <laughs> oh, Beatrice. Look at that beautiful fourth lumber vertebrae. Oh, Beatrice. How can you be this enchanting? There cannot be another woman more beautiful than you. Oh, this is my angel. Uh... Some guy was embracing a skeleton model and ardently confessing his love in the morning. <laughs> Fucking, this is this is what I dream of. This is this is <laughs> life goals. He's so good looking. What a shame. Not what a shame. This is the goal. <laughs> <laughs> there are more than a few people who are blessed with good looks, but miserably fail at using them. He is not. <laughs> Would others think like this of me playing with dolls? Yes. yes. I feel like he's <laughs> honestly better off than you because you're clearly using the dolls as a coping mechanism instead of like going to therapy or something like that to help yourself deal with the loss of your grandfather. Meanwhile, he just wants to bone a skeleton. Let's make sure no one knows. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My belief that some hobbies should remain a secret was not wrong. Mr. Yuji, I I heard you asked for me. He looked at me with bitter eyes. Boner! Interrupting their private quality yeah, time. This is great. He was so into his skeleton. This is so oh, this is hilarious. He looks dandy as always. Just the looks. We got it. All right, stop hating on my fave, all right? I do not like this girl. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, a student. I asked for you for, uh, I asked for you some time ago and now you're here. Yes, that's generally how it works. He had me run errands that often. What? But still doesn't know my name. He doesn't know the name of most kids. Oh, but he did seem to remember Zoe and Shinbi's names. He's planning to make them part of the connection, the, the collection. Probably because they're pretty? Yeah, that's how it works, bro. <laughs> of course, his idea of beauty is a bit different from those of others. Skeletons. <laughs> oh. Sorry, I forgot. Oh, right, this is me. I got distracted by dude bro swords. <laughs> hmm. Oh, fuck. Let me do my voice. <laughs> it was about to just be me. Uh, hmm. Well, alright. Move that guy to the prep room. Oh, please. Let there be murder. He pointed at the upper body anatomy model frequently used during classes. He teaches classes? His name was, I think, Christopher? <laughs> Christopher Watkins! Whenever I ran errands, he often told me all kinds of stories. One of them was about Christopher. Christopher is apparently Beatrice's half-brother. Mr. Eugen is honestly annoyed with him, but he takes care of him because Beatrice adores him. <coughs> I'm so into this. Like, dude, he's got such a beautiful fucking thing going on with his Skelebros. Man, fucking make this your next game, guys. Such a tear-jerking story. Get Cherits on the line. <laughs> I demand a Skele romance. alone. So, like, bully of- Although the model was just the upper body, 
It was too heavy for a girl to carry alone. So bully a freshman into doing it for you. <laughs> I picked the model up in quite an unattractive pose. He didn't give me a single glance despite me struggling to pick it up. Well, well, Mr. Eugen, I'll be heading out. I like when she's dying, you die. <laughs> You're a very good method actor. Oh, Beatrice, how can you have such a beautiful shoulder blades? How can you seduce me like this? I already adore every particle of you. I should close the door when I head out. No, seriously, nobody needs to see him try to fuck this skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> Some kids who were passing by heard his voice through the open door and started whispering. Some argued that it didn't matter because he looks cute. I agree. If I'm not to ruin my life, with just one choice, I would quit thinking that. Someone else said he's too creepy and asked if he's not crazy. <coughs> hmm, I agree. Ugh, heavy! Popular opinions. And then she dies. Whoa! What did you do? I clicked the button! I, I think I clicked the right button. <laughs> oh my god, I did a thing! Oh, it feels so good to have done something useful once in my life. <laughs> Click the right... Yeah! Script? Sp what is... Oh, uh, text speed. Oh, you can turn off the specific voices if you want. <clears throat> Christopher, I mean, this model was indeed too heavy for a girl to carry. I don't know, kid. I've carried paintings that weigh as much as myself to class every day. I think she's just a bitch who fucking Probably. doesn't eat or work out or anything. She's just being a little bitch about it. I mean, she spends most of her money on dolls. I think she's probably... And she spends the rest of her time just sitting in her house, staring <laughs> into the empty book. So, I feel like she's, like, slightly emaciated. Like, <laughs> like she's not even at the normal levels of girl who just doesn't work out. Like, she's, like, ama like literally has, like, starved herself for these fucking dolls. <laughs> the only reason why I can manage to carry it is because my trained arm muscles are used to carrying 2k dolls every day 2k how much is that google it gonna do the math Ugh. so many boys pass by but no one even looks no one notices me because i'm too ordinary anyways four pound dolls so heavy <laughs> What the- first of all, what the fuck are your dolls made out of? Lead? <laughs> like, what? How big are they- wait, wait, they had those on the thing. I, I'm gonna go find out what the dolls are when they're not okay. men. And we're gonna find out. We're gonna fucking solve this fucking bullshit. Things would be different for Zoe and Shinbi. Zoe would have shoved the boys around like a queen. And for Shinbi, girls would have volunteered to help. I smirked and imagining all that. I don't really feel bitter, though. Really? I agree, I'm... too, that their looks attract people. I'm not bitter at all. Oh, no. Recess will be over soon. I should hurry up. I'm here. Guys, I'm back. Are, are oh, we, never we, mind. Do we have guys yet? There's no heights <coughs> for them when they're dolls. I thought they were, like, regular ball joint dolls. Yeah. So they shouldn't be that big. Uh, like, it should be big enough, like, to warrant that size, like, that weight. Well, ball joint dolls usually have a metal armature, much like uh, so puppets the, do. So the, so the metal could do it. 
Yeah. But it's, that's still not a They're lot. They're made similarly to stop motion puppets. They're, that's still not a lot. <laughs> this girl's a wimp. Oh my god. I'm unsurprised though. <laughs> I'm tired. I carried like one thing the whole day. I threw myself onto the sofa without even taking my uniform off. Usually I just walk around the house naked. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> as I buried myself in the comfy sofa, I felt as if all my sore muscles were screaming. God, my shoulders. Tomorrow I'm definitely not going. Even if Mr. Eugene asks for me, all I do is suffer. I turned around on the sofa. As usual, I blankly stared at the ceiling <laughs> for the rest of the night. 